Hello everyone, welcome along. Today we're in the bathroom. Notice that the old pop-up basin waste was running a little bit slow. I know what it is, it's kind of a little bit of a yucky job. If you're up to it and you want to watch this one, <laughs> I'll show you how to clean it. <laughs> Take my advice, it's awful, I can't watch. <laughs> So with these pop-up wastes, usually it is the actual pop-up that blocks up more than the actual trap or the bend. So a lot of times when this starts running slow, this is usually the cause. So it's quite simple, just makes your pop-up a little bit so you can get a hold of it, your fingers around it and pull away. It might be stuck with hair and stuff, but you will find it looking a bit like that, I'm afraid rather mm, a bit mucky. I have a little bowl bucket, I've got an old garage bucket here to put it into to clean it out, which I put it into. I'm going to dismantle most of that now and see if we can get that hair out of there. So, usually nine times out of ten, it's hair and soap that block these things up and uh, it just needs pulling out. Wear gloves if you're a bit squeamish. Me being a real man, I just use my fingers and get it out, it's going to be really duck in there and put it in that old bowl which I'm going to put some water in after this is done, disinfectant it and flush it down the toilet. And wash your hands. And wash my hands oh, afterwards. Oh, sorry. It's lovely isn't it in there. Now we'll need a screwdriver to poke some of it through. This is why I've got the screwdriver handy. Clean it right through all the holes. And as you can see the hair then pops out the back of it there and we're starting to get it clear. How's your stomach? Mine's oh, really bad. I'm just a bit going up. where all this hair comes from. I'm completely bald. Okay. <laughs> right, I'm going to wash that a bit now, get some of that out of there. What do you think, Mo? It's horrible, isn't it? I haven't got most of the hair out, so it's not going back down the sink. There's just a few little bits of black bits in there now. I'll just run it over the top and get an old toothbrush to get it down in there. But you can use anything to get down in there to clean this out. And then once the worst is gone, you can bring it all back. If you look down the sink, before you put this back, there's a little lever down there. See it there, that little shiny piece? Just make sure there's no hair or anything stuck on there as, as well. If there is, just scrape it off with a screwdriver, make sure that's clean as well. Once that's done, we're kind of ready to put it back. I've got a little bit of stuff over the back of my pin there. I'm just going to wipe that off now with a screwdriver, get it off. There we are then, there's no need to really shine it up or anything because it will get black and dirty again pretty quick. So just make sure it's all nice and clean through the grids. It's a little bit black in there, but not that's not right, that's quite normal. Um, and get back in the slot, so get it back when you pop up there. And we're back ready to go, should be nice and clear again now. Yeah, that's looking good now. That's better, it was <laughs> kind of a bit slower this morning. <laughs> that's better. Yep, great job. So there we are, horrible job. Sorry for those of you with a weak stomach. <laughs> there you go. All my stuff, you know where to go. Derek and 33. Thanks for watching guys. Bye bye.